Hey everybody, I'm going to show you the correct way to remove the torsion spring rods that hold up the trunk deck lid. This is in a uh, 67 cutlass and it'll be the same for most of the A-body cars that GM made and also, well, some other cars as well. Anyway, um, first thing you want to do, if you're going to do this right, the best thing to do is to remove the deck lid. And um, that'll make it a lot easier if you don't have that weight hanging up above you while you're in the trunk. There are two attachment points. This is the driver's side or, or left-hand uh, hinge for the deck lid. And the torsion rod connects into this point right here. There are two um, places where the hinge is hinged. There's the main hinge pin up there, and then you've got this other little cam here that the spring fits into. And then at the other end, you've got your adjustment uh, for the amount of tension that you want on the rod. It's a good idea to take pictures of everything to know where each side lines up, which, which uh, uh, notch you're in over there, and, and which rod is up on top here as well as it crosses. So in order to do this, basically you just need a pair of, of um, vice grips, and I'd use the ones with the flat uh, straight jaws on it, and then um, you know some type of a hammer. I've got a dead blow hammer here. What you need to do is to get this where it relieves tension over to here. So you're going to put channel or device grips on this and you're going to pull it toward the back in order to relieve some tension and at the same time you're going to take your dead blow hammer or just a regular hammer and tap this up a little bit and the reason you want to tap that up is to get it out of this notch once you get this raised up and out of that notch you'll let it go over to this position which takes off a bunch of the tension there's still going to be some tension on it but uh, this is the first step now the second step is you come back over here to the other side You're going to take your uh, vice grips and put on this part of the spring right here. You're going to pull down on the spring and it'll let this hinged piece drop down out of the way. Okay, so once it drops down out of the way, your, hand, your uh, spring is totally free and you can pull it out this way, which will get it out of this slot over here, and, and you remove it. Um, in order to put it back in, you just reverse the process. Now again, if the deck lid is off, you need to tie the hinge in the up position so it's out of your way. You can either tie it, you could have somebody hold it, um, you could use a uh, welding magnet, whatever. So you put your rod back into position, uh, which would be in that slot right there. Pull down on this, and at the same time you have to swing this little cam back up so it engages right there. Okay, so your first step to reinstall, put it in place, Pull this down, get this cam in place. Okay, and then you come back over here, raise this up a little bit where you can clear the uh, notches and then get your pliers and bring it back and then pull it down. Once you get it at the right notch, you just have to 
press it down so it so it stays in that notch. Good luck.